Welcome to this video showcase for our 2010 Jaguar XF portfolio. So this is the three litre diesel. This is also the S model, which is the uh, increased horsepower. Absolutely fantastic. The top portfolio is the uh, complete top of the range model. Uh, comes absolutely packed with features, which I'll, uh, I'll talk you through in a second. Um, the color of this particular car is called Caviar. Um, it's, uh, I think the video seems to be doing quite a good job of picking up the color. Sometimes it doesn't always work, but it's quite a, a real sort of dark, they actually call it red, but it's, um, uh, it's definitely a, a, like a really dark purple, um, but uh, Jackie would call it caviar. I think it's absolutely stunning. It's sort of quite a bit of purple and a bit of brown in it. Um, really uh, sets off with the uh, the 20 inch Selena alloy wheels that we see here. Um, the car itself in absolutely fantastic condition. I mean, it's approaching 60,000, sorry, just gone over 60,000 miles. Um, it's obviously an eight year old car, but I mean, it is in fantastic condition. It's been beautifully uh, looked after inside and out. Um, and I just think these are such incredible value now when you consider the sort of level of specification that you have on the car. Um, Eagle Eye viewers may have already spotted the uh, Jag number plate that's included in the sale. Um, that is actually, uh, it's, it's been on that, um, on that number plate since the car was new. Um, but yeah, absolutely fantastic condition. I think you've, you'd have to look very, very uh, closely to sort of find any small blemishes. I think there's a, a very small scratch just on the, I don't even know if the camera's picking it up just on the right quarter there. Um, it's not gone fully through the paint, um, but uh, that's pretty much the only thing I would really want to point out to you. The rest of the car is in uh, extremely good condition. Boot area, all lovely and clean. All the chrome's been, uh, been beautifully polished up. Uh, looks fantastic. Like I said, all, uh, all wheels and tires are also in very, very good condition. Just have a quick look in the back. We have the beautiful ivory leather seats. Again, all absolutely immaculate. Barely looks like it's been sat in in the back actually. Uh, the backs of the seats, all free of any scuff marks. We also have this beautiful Alcantara sort of suede headlining. Again, all in fantastic condition. Absolutely uh, no sign that this car's ever been smoked in. Uh, certainly had any pets or anything like that in it as well. Um, the interior really, really is absolutely perfect. See all the uh, white leather door cards and everything like that. You see these when they've not been looked after don't tend to wear particularly well. Uh, but this particular example has obviously been cherished all the way through, as we'll see from here. These seats are, are both heated and ventilated as well. Um, so you actually have small fans um, which uh, use the air conditioning and they will actually blow cold air uh, onto your back. Um, when you're sat in the car. Uh, that just works on the front seats. We also have a, a Bowers and Wilkins sound system. Beautiful uh, white stitching all the way around on the leather. Again, you can just see the condition of the door handles uh, and, uh, and all of the leather on here. And a lovely extended leather dashboard as well. Like I said, these portfolio models are, have got such a high specification. Um, I really don't see why anybody would want to be buying the, uh, the sort of luxury or the premium luxury models when these are available. Uh, the car also features a fully keyless system um, so to simply lock the car you just press the button on the outside there the uh, power folding mirrors will also come in and to open the car just simply put your hand on the handle and the car will open. So round to the driver's side again driver's bolster and everything like that all in exceptional condition. Um, the 
tiniest little sort of small areas of, um, of cracking on the leather just really where it's um, bedding in there but it's it's certainly nothing excessive at all really really lovely condition uh, the drivers and passengers seats are electrically adjustable and we also have memory for the uh, drivers side and that will also remember the mirror position and also uh, the electric steering column as well so we have a, a, a decent uh, easy access function where the steering wheel will move out of your way and then drop back down to your memorized position when you start the car as we'll see mileage 62819 so just coming up to 63,000 miles just cool that down uh, we also have on the steering wheel here the adaptive cruise control functions uh, so it has a, a radar on the front uh, which will pick up the car uh, in front of you and will just hold your your uh, your speed behind them uh, accelerate when they move out of the way or obviously brake all the way to a halt uh, in front of you also have the settings for the media system and telephone as well as being able to sort of uh, cycle through your radio uh, iPod connections and uh, CD etc Really nice infotainment screen up on here. Again, control most of the uh, the options for the uh, dual zone climate control, as well as the heated and ventilated seats. So we just put that on, and that will uh, kick in the ventilated seats, which I can feel coming through now. Um, we also have a heated front windscreen, uh, which is great in the winter. Wish I'd had one last year throughout the uh, throughout the winter. So um, rather than having to get your scraper out, you literally just get come in and press defrost, and the uh, heated windscreen will take care of the rest for you. Further options on here, we have the navigation, like I said it's a touchscreen system, all works absolutely as it should do uh, and very elegantly finished inside. Glove box, we have all of the um, books and manuals and everything like that, decent amount of storage in the front, storage compartments there, cup holders here, and then into the front centre armrest we have the connections for your USB auxiliary and then also an additional power socket in the front there as well. Further features, automatic headlights, automatic windscreen wipers, uh, the headlights are uh, Xenon adaptive lights so they will follow you uh, around corners and things like that. Um, when you're not using the climate control system, as with a lot of Jaguars, you just turn this off and the air vents close up for you uh, just to stop from dust from getting into there and then similarly with the uh, control knob for the for the gear shift when you turn the engine off that sinks back down into the main system so beautifully finished um, unrivaled really in, in that sort of way uh, we also have if you can see the little orange light on the mirrors on both sides it's just gone off that one we can see it there it is um, that is a blind spot warning indicator uh, so when there's a car coming up behind you in your blind spot it'll warn you not to over overtake that literally will just flash red at you um, but yeah as again as you can see all absolutely beautifully cared for ivory leather you've got this nice wood finish um, inside and then we also have uh, a rear blind here as well so we press that and the sun blind comes up at the back and back down again so really, apart from a sunroof, I don't think there's any options that are missing off this that you would get on any other XFs. So bodywork, all oh, absolutely beautiful. It's been so well looked after. Um, you're obviously going to get a few stone chips. There's obviously, you know, that sort of thing is unavoidable, unfortunately. But over and above, you can tell that uh, that the car's been extremely well looked after. Um, like I said all the chrome has been um, been treated nicely and polished up. No sort of watermarks or anything like that on there, which you can often get. Um, it really, really is a exceptional car. I uh, hope you found the video useful. If we can help with any further information, then please don't hesitate to contact us through our website, which is influencecars.co.uk. Uh, we'd be delighted to help you with a finance proposal um, or value a part exchange for you, um, or just to organise a test drive and a, and a viewing. But um, certainly well worth coming to have a look at. Um, like I said, I, I just think these are such good value now. Uh, car drives absolutely beautifully, uh, plenty of power, decent economy, and uh, looks extremely smart. Plus you've got the benefit of the uh, Jaguar number plate that comes with the car so yeah a few of these getting a little bit tired and old now but this certainly is not one of them um, a very very smart car and uh, I'm sure you'd be delighted when you come to see it uh, any more questions please do let us know thanks very much again for watching and we will see you next time thank you